Hi, this is George Cow. A quick video to show you how to find your Kindle highlights on your private Kindle web page so that you can share your highlights, your notes with your friends. Maybe you can even upload it to Google Drive and share it with a specific audience that you have in mind. So, all right, first thing you got to do is go to kindle.amazon.com slash your underscore highlights. I will put that link underneath the video as well. Kindle.amazon.com slash your underscore highlights. Okay, so once you get here and once you're logged in, what you're going to see is you're going to see your highlights starting from the most recent book that you've been highlighting. Okay, so executive toughness at this point happens to be the one. If you keep scrolling down, I'm going to show you what happens. If you keep scrolling down, it'll show you all of the highlights from, from that one book. And then at the bottom, you'll see loading. And loading means that it's now loading highlights from the next book, uh, most recent book you've been highlighting. And uh, anyway, it's going to take a little while, but that's, that's what's going to happen there. Um, but if you want to, now you mind you, well, if I can, can I just find, oh, there it is. Um, there it is, and then, you know, mo, more and et cetera, more of my books. So if you say, well, what if I want to just find a book I read a while ago, want to find those highlights? Well, you can use the search box on the upper right. So one book I thought about was Real Happiness at Work. Um, I'm, uh, it doesn't always give that suggestion. I, I give that suggestion because I typed it just uh, a minute ago. But Real Happiness at Work, I'm going to click Search. Okay, so there's a bit of a tricky part. First of all, you've got to find the right book. So click on the book title. And then after that, you, you want to look on the upper right here, on this, this uh, side of the screen. And if it says you own a different edition of the book, you've got to click on Different Edition. And then once you do that, you then have to click on, it says how many highlights you have, but you can only show 184 of them. Just If it says you have a lot of highlights, but you can only show a certain number of them publicly, it's because of the publisher's uh, limitations or whatever. So just click on this area here. And once you do that, you now can see all the highlights from that book. And so, for example, all the highlights and all of your notes from the book, in the case this is my notes and my highlights, and then if you, if, I, if you scroll down to the very bottom again, you'll see the loading thing. And once that happens, it's now loading your most recent highlights, which, as you saw earlier, was my, the book Executive Toughness for me anyway. So before it gets to the loading, you can basically, uh, it's already loaded. All of your um, uh, notes were on a single page, already loaded for this book. And what you can do is you could save the web page um, let's see here. You can click on File on your uh, web browser. You can click Save Page As and then or Print, uh, and then you could do the um, Print as PDF. You can save that as a PDF to your um, to your computer, and then you can even upload it to Google Drive and share it with the audience that you want to share it with. So I hope that's helpful. Um, if you have any questions, comment below the video. Uh, either I or someone else may be able to help. And with that, wishing you a great day.